गुड मॉर्निंग टूडे वी डिस्कस सम इम्पोर्टेंट प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द चैप्टर पर्सेंट फ्रैक्शन एंड इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ रेशनल फंक्शन एक्सरसाइज नाइन एक नंबर थ्री डबल आई इंटीग्रेट फाइव एक्स बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स प्लस टू होल इनटू एक्स प्लस वन ओके लेट फाइव एक्स बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स प्लस टू होल इनटू एक्स प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस बी डिवाइडेड बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स प्लस टू प्लस सी बाय एक्स प्लस वन हियर एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स प्लस टू इज ए क्वाड्रेटिक फंक्शन एंड एक्स प्लस वन इज ए लिनियर फंक्शन सो वी राइट ए क्वाड्रेटिक फंक्शन आज द पर्सन फ्रैक्शन ए एक्स प्लस बी डिवाइडेड बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स प्लस टू एंड ए लिनियर फंक्शन आज सी बाय एक्स प्लस वन नाउ क्लियरिंग द फ्रैक्शन That means we multiply both sides of equation one with x square minus two x plus two whole into x plus one. We get five x is equal to a x plus b whole into x plus one plus c whole into x square minus two x plus two. So now equating both sides, equating the coefficient of a x square on both sides of equation two, we get. A plus C is equal to zero. A plus C is equal to zero. That way, here the x square term is absent, so its coefficient is zero. And then here the coefficient of x square is a x square a plus C. Okay. Now, equating the coefficient of x on both sides of equation two, we get a plus b a plus b. Minus two c minus two c is equal to five. Equation four put x is equal to minus one in equation two. We get five x to minus one that equal to that term becomes zero. Or we get zero plus c in whole into minus one square minus two minus into minus one plus two. That means minus five is equal to minus minus. Minus five is equal to five c. That equal to c is equal to minus five by five. That equal to minus one. Now we put c is equal to minus one in equation three. Now we put c is equal to put c is equal to put c equal to minus one in equation three. We get A minus one is equal to zero. That implies a equal to one. A equal to one. Now we put a and value of a and c in equation four. Put a put a is equal to one and c is equal to minus one in equation four. We get one plus b minus two whole into minus one is equal to five. That implies one plus b plus two is equal to five. That implies b plus three is equal to five. That implies b is equal to five minus three is equal to two. Okay. Now we put the value of a, b, c in equation one. Put the put a equal to one, b equal to two, and c equal to minus one in equation one. We get five x by x square minus two x plus two whole into x plus one is equal to x plus two x plus two by x square minus two x plus two and minus one by x plus one. Okay. Now we integrate both sides. 
Now integrating both sides both sides that in integral 5x by x square minus 2x plus 2 holding to x plus 1 that equal to x plus 1 dx that equal to integral x plus 2 by x square minus 2x plus 2 plus integral minus 1 by x plus 1 dx that equal to now the derivative of the x square minus 2x plus 2 is if 2x minus 2 so we multiply 2 on the numerator and divide 2 so we get 1 by 2 2x plus 4 divided by x square minus 2x plus 2 dx minus integral 1 by x plus 1 dx that equal to 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 2 plus 6 x square minus 2x plus 2 dx minus ln x plus 1 more you know dx by x plus 1 is equal to ln x plus 1 now we separate it 2x that equal to 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 2 by x square minus 2x plus 2 plus 6 by x square minus 2x plus 2 whole dx minus ln x plus 1 more that equal to 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 2 x square minus 2x plus 2 dx plus 6 by 2 integral dx by x square minus 2x plus 2 minus ln x plus 1 mod that is equal to 1 by 2 ln x square minus 2x plus 2 mod plus 3 integral dx by now we make a thing as the whole square form we get x square minus 2x plus 1 plus 1 that minus ln x plus 1 mod that equal to you know the derivative of x square minus 2x plus 2 is 2x minus 2 so its integral is ln x square minus 2x plus 2 that equal to 1 by 2 ln x square minus 2x plus 2 mod plus 3 integral dx by x minus 1 whole square plus 1 square minus ln x plus 1 mod that equal to 1 by 2 ln x square minus 2x plus 2 mod minus plus 3 plus 3 into that uh, dx by x square plus a square you know tan inverse x by a 1 by a tan inverse x by a here in place of a is 1 so we write a 1 by 1 tan inverse x minus 1 by 1 minus ln x plus 1 mod plus c that finally we get 1 by 2 ln x square minus 2x plus 2 mod plus 3 tan inverse x minus 1 minus ln x plus 1 mod plus c ok that is the answer here oh, if we put x minus 1 in place of x minus 1 t then we get dt by t square plus of 1 square then 1 by 1 tan inverse t by 1 that in place of t put x minus of 1 okay here we make a directly
then next we discuss another important problem number 3 triple i triple i integrate 3 by x q minus 1 dx answer now 3 by x q minus 1 is equal to 3 by x minus 1 whole into x square plus x plus 1 that 1 is in non-repeated linear factor another is in non-repeated quadratic factor let a 3 by x q minus 1 that a we write x q minus 1 is equal to 3 by x minus 1 whole into x square plus x plus 1 that equal to a by x minus 1 non repeated linear factor so we write some constant by factor plus bx plus c divided by x square plus x plus 1 that equation 1 now clearing the fraction clearing the fraction we get 3 is equal to a whole into x square plus x plus 1 plus bx plus c whole into x minus 1 that 2 equating the coefficient of a x square equating the coefficient of a x square on both sides of a equation 2 we get a plus b is equal to 0 3 here on the left side there is no term containing x square so we'll see coefficient is 0 right hand side a and b so a plus b is equal to 0 now equating the coefficient of now equating the constant of now equating the constant of equating the constant term term on both sides sides of a equation 2 we get a minus c is equal to 3 equation 4 a minus c is equal to 3 now put to x is equal to 1 put to x is equal to 1 put to x is equal to 1 in equation 2 we get 3 is equal to a whole into 1 square plus 1 plus 1 plus 0 here we put x is equal to 1 that term vanishes 0 that implies 3 is equal to a 3a that implies a 3a is equal to 3 that implies a is equal to 3 by 3 is equal to 1 put to a equal to 1 in equation 3 we get 1 plus b is equal to 0 that implies b is equal to minus 1 b is equal to minus 1 also put to go to a equal to 1 in equation 4 we get 1 minus c is equal to 3 that implies c is equal to 1 minus 3 that equal to minus 2 c is equal to minus 2 so we put the value of a b c in equation 1 now we put the value of a b c in equation 1 put a equal to 1 
go to a equal to 1 b equal to minus 1 and c is equal to minus 2 in equation 1 we get 3 by x q minus 1 is equal to 3 by x minus 1 whole into x square plus x plus 1 that is a q minus b q formula that equal to 1 by x minus 1 plus minus x dx plus c so we write here minus x minus 2 by x square plus x plus 1 that is becomes <coughs> 1 by x minus 1 minus x plus 2 by x square plus x plus 1 now integrating both sides integrating both sides we get integral 3 by x q minus 1 dx integral 1 by x minus 1 dx minus integral x plus 2 by x square plus x plus 1 dx that equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus here the derivative of x square plus x plus 1 is 2x plus 1 so now we multiply 2 on the numerator and divide 2 on the denominator so we get minus 1 by 2 integral 2x plus 4 divided by x square plus x plus 1 dx ok next that is equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 that is integral now divide 2x plus 4 as 2x plus 1 plus 3 2x plus 1 plus 3 so we write 2x plus 1 plus 3 divided by x square plus x plus 1 dx ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 integral 2x plus 1 by x square plus x plus 1 plus 3 by x square plus x plus 1 dx that is equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 integral 2x plus 1 x square plus x plus 1 dx plus minus 3 by 2 3 by 2 integral dx by x square plus x plus 1 that is ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 mod minus 3 by 2 integral dx by x square plus 2 into 1 by 2 into x plus 1 by 2 whole square plus 1 minus 1 by 2 whole square here we add 1 by 2 whole square and subtract to 1 by 2 whole square that equal to that equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 mod minus 3 by 2 integral dx by x plus 1 by 2 whole square plus 1 minus 1 by 4 that equal to 3 by 4 ok that equal to 3 by 4 ln x minus 1 more minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 more minus 3 by 2 integral dx by 
x plus 1 by 2 whole square plus 3 by 4 3 by 4 that is equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 minus 3 by 2 integral dx by x plus 1 by 2 whole square plus root 3 by 2 whole square plus root 3 by 2 whole square ok that way if we put x plus in place of x plus 1 by 2 as t then we get dt by t square plus a square that equal to 1 by a tan inverse t by a so we write a ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 mod minus 3 by 2 into 1 by root 3 by 2 tan inverse x plus 1 by 2 by root 3 by 2 plus c ok that equal to ln x minus 1 mod minus 1 by 2 ln x square plus x plus 1 that is cancelling 2 2 that is minus root 3 tan inverse 2x plus 1 divided by root 3 plus c tan inverse 2x plus 1 by root 3 plus c answer ok next we will discuss another important problem integrate x to the that is question 3 IV integrate integrate x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x cube plus x square plus 4x plus 1 divided by x cube plus 1 dx ok now answer now x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x cube plus x square plus 4x plus 1 divided by x cube plus 1 here the integral is improper algebraic fraction so now we divide the numerator with the denominator in it that is x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x cube plus x square plus 4x plus 1 that is x cube plus 1 as a now we multiply x square x to the power 5 plus x square that minus minus x to the power 4 plus x cube plus 4x plus 1 now we multiply plus x so we get x to the power 4 plus x that is minus minus x cube plus 3x plus 1 now we multiply plus 1 that is x cube plus 1 that in the subtracting we get only 3x so we write this as a sum of a polynomial and a proper fraction that equal to we write the x square plus x plus 1 as polynomial plus 3x by x cube plus 1 one of the proper algebraic fraction so integral of then we write so integral of this x cube x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x cube plus x square plus 4x plus 1 divided by x cube plus 1 is the integral of that polynomial function and a proper algebraic function fraction so integral of this dx integral of dx 
that you that dx plus integral of 3x by x cube plus 1 dx okay that we write in integral x square dx plus integral x dx plus integral 1 dx plus integral 3x by x plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 dx okay that equal to x cube by 3 plus x square by 2 plus x plus integral 3x by x plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 dx equation 1 okay now we integrate only the proper algebraic fraction 3x by x cube plus 1 or 3x by x plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 okay let a let a 3x by x plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 equal to a by x plus 1 non-limited linear factor that quadratic factor a bx plus c by x square minus x plus 1 equation 2 now clearing the fraction now clearing the fraction clearing the fraction 3x is equal to a whole into x square minus x plus 1 plus bx plus c whole into x plus 1 3 now equating the coefficient of x square on both sides equating the coefficient of x square on both sides of equation 3 we get a plus b is equal to 0 on the left side no term containing x square so its coefficient is 0 on the right hand side coefficient of x square is b a plus b a plus b is equal to 0 number 4 now equating the coefficient of x equating the coefficient of x on both sides of equation 3 we get on the left side coefficient of x is 3 on the right hand side minus a plus b plus c minus a plus b plus c is equal to 3 number 5 Okay, now we put x is equal to minus 1. Put x is equal to minus 1 in equation 3. We get that term becomes 0. So only we have 3 into minus 1 that equal to a equal to minus 1 square minus of minus 1 plus 1 that minus 3 that equal to 3a that imply a is equal to minus 3 by 3 is equal to minus 1 minus 3 by 3 equal to minus 1 ok put a is equal to minus 1 in equation 4 put a equal to minus 1 in equation we get 
minus 1 plus b equal to 0 that imply b equal to 1 b equal to 1 again put the value of a and b in equation in equation 5 put a is equal to minus 1 and b equal to 1 in equation 5 we get that minus minus of minus 1 plus 1 plus c equal to 3 1 plus 1 plus c is equal to 3 that 2 plus c equal to 3 c is equal to 3 minus 2 equal to 1 c is equal to 3 minus 1 3 minus 2 equal to 1 so put the value of abc in equation 1 sorry in equation 2 put the value of put to a equal to minus 1 b equal to 1 and c equal to 1 c equal to 1 a equal to minus 1 b equal to 1 c is equal to 1 in equation 2 equation 2 we get 3x by 3x by x2 plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 that equal to minus 1 by x plus 1 plus of x plus 1 bx plus c that becomes x plus 1 x square minus x plus 1 now integrating both sides integrating both sides okay integral 3x by x plus 1 whole into x square minus x plus 1 dx integral minus 1 by x plus 1 dx plus integral x plus 1 by x square minus x plus 1 dx that equal to minus ln x plus 1 mod plus that you know the derivative of x square minus x plus 1 is 2x minus 1 so we multiply 2 on the numerator divide 2 on the denominator x square minus x plus 1 dx that equal to minus ln x plus 1 mod plus 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 1 plus 3 x square minus x plus 1 dx ok now we separate that equal to minus ln x plus 1 mod plus 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 1 by x square minus x plus 1 plus 3 by x square minus x plus 1 dx minus ln x plus 1 mod plus 1 by 2 integral 2x minus 1 x square minus x plus 1 dx plus 3 by 2 integral dx by x square minus x plus 1 ok that equal to minus ln x plus 1 mod plus 1 by 2 ln the derivative of this denominator on the numerator so we write ln of denominator x square minus x plus 1 mod plus 3 by 2 integral dx by now we express it in the whole square form x square minus 2 into 1 by 2 into x plus 1 by 2 whole square plus 1 minus 1 by 2 whole square that equal to minus ln x plus 1 mod plus 1 by 2 ln 
एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस एक्स प्लस वन मोड प्लस थ्री बाय टू इंटीग्रल डी एक्स बाय एक्स माइनस वन बाय टू होल स्क्वायर प्लस वन माइनस वन बाय फोर प्लस वन माइनस वन बाय फोर ओके दैट इक्वल टू माइनस एलेन एक्स प्लस वन मोड प्लस वन बाय टू एक्स स्क्वायर माइन एलेन वन बाय टू एलेन एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस एक्स प्लस वन मोड प्लस थ्री बाय टू इंटीग्रल डी एक्स बाय एक्स माइनस वन बाय टू होल स्क्वायर प्लस थ्री बाय फोर That equal to minus ln x plus one mod plus one by two ln x square minus x plus one mod plus three by two integral d x by x minus half whole square plus three by two whole square. That equal to minus ln x plus one mod plus one by two ln x square. Minus x plus one mod plus three by two into one by three by two tan inverse x minus one by two by three by two plus c. Okay, that equal to you know the integration of d t by t square plus s square into one by tan inverse t by t. Here we apply this formula. So now, in cancel two two and a root three three, we get plus root three. That equal to root three. That tan inverse tan inverse two x minus one by root three plus c. So root three tan inverse. Where three by two, okay. That is plus c. Now put this. So equation one becomes. Integral x to the power five plus x to the power four plus x cube plus x square plus four x plus one divided by x cube plus one dx. That equal to x cube by three plus x square by two plus x minus Ln x plus one mod plus one by two. Ln x square minus x plus one mod plus one by plus root three. Tan inverse two x minus one by root three plus c. Okay, answer. Thank you.